Hello children, today I am going to teach you environmental studies of standard 1. The other name of this subject is EVS. This is our EVS book. Green World, a book on environmental studies. So now I am going to teach you the second lesson of EVS. The name of this lesson is My Body. As we all know that there are different parts in our body. So today we will see all the parts of the body. So now look here. Here is a picture of a boy and in this picture there are different parts of the body. So now start reading all the parts of the body with me. Head. This upper part of the body is known as head. This brown color part that you can see is known as our hair. This part is known as ear and there are two ears. Eyes. This is known as an eye and there are two eyes. Nose. There is only one nose. Mouth. This part is known as mouth and inside the mouth you can see the white color part that is known as teeth and this part is known as lips and inside the mouth you can see that pink color part that is known as tongue. And this part that you can see is known as our shoulder. And all these things, all these that you can see are known as fingers. And in one hand there are five fingers. And in both the hands there are ten fingers. This part that you can see, this is known as palm. And this whole part that you can see is known as hand. This upper part of the body is known as chest. And below the chest, this part is known as stomach. Legs. This whole part is known as leg. And this area that you can see inside the circle is known as knee. And the upper part of the knee is known as thigh. And this part that you can see is known as foot. And this area that you can see inside the circle is known as ankle. This part that you can see, this is known as arm and this part that you can see is known as elbow. This white part is known as nails. The area below the head is known as neck. So, all these are the different parts of the body. Now, we will see how these body parts help us. First, we will read all these lines. We speak with our mouth. We walk and run with our legs. We clap, paint, draw, write and hold things with our hands. We see things around us with our eyes. We hear with our ears. We smell with our nose. So, with the help of mouth, we can speak or we can eat. And with the help of legs, we can walk run or we can jump and with the help of hands we can clap we can paint we can draw we can write we can hold things and also we can do many other things with the help of hands eyes with the help of eyes we can see everything around us and with the help of ears we can hear and with the help of nose we can smell thank you